They didn't leave last night, the zebras, but they didn't get eaten either. So I suppose that's a good thing. Sun is rising. We're getting ready. So here we go. Okay, so basically what we're going to show you today is how you can do a self-driving Kruger National Park um, and compare it to an open vehicle with a guide um, safari. So we've done the open vehicle guide safari every day this week and we have seen some cool stuff. But downfalls to that, you're on somebody else's time limit and you are on their schedule for food and whatever. And not so much their schedule, but like the driver and the other people that you're with. And other people. Yeah, So you, and you have to be respectful of that. We're by ourselves, so we can do what we want. But we are, and we're in an SUV, so, you know, we're a bit higher than, say, a Corolla. Yep. So, yeah, we're going to show you what we can do. Anyway, first things first. You first get to the first gate, and we're at Alperin. Alperin? Gate. Alperin Gate. And you get an identity form to fill out. Basically, it's just things like... You know who you are, what car you're in, blah blah blah. Think about like that. Signing it to say if you get out and be a dickhead, it's your own fault. You're not allowed to get out. You're not allowed to fly the drone here for because po like that's what poachers do. Um, just you know, basically the rules. Um, so yeah, that's your first thing. Your first gate, you get in, you get the form, you come up to the next gate, you fill it out, and you go. It's our zoo. So we came to a traffic jam and then we realized that there was a impala in a tree and generally that's not where they live so <laughs> so that means there's a leopard around here somewhere and the leopard has put his lunch in the tree for later so he's just there there are lions up on the hill and there's two something somethings co co whatever the fuck they are bambies walking along the riverbed and they're fully interested. They are interested, but like the lions up on the hill have cubs. <gasps> they're making a move. They are. Holy shit. He fucking is too. Oh. He's doing the stalk. He's fucking stalking. Oh. She, by the way. Oh, she, she, she's stalking. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, oh. Shannon, where are the fucking Bambies? Oh, Bambies are all the way down there. It doesn't matter. Oh, it's it doesn't fucking matter. Totally happening. <whistles> Shut up, birds. Fucking interested, isn't it? And all of the lines are now at attention, not just like the curious one they're at the all, start. They're all like. Fuck it, it's go day. Can you see? Oh, oh, yeah, I even, oh, I even, I even just want to see a chase. The wildebeest now knows he has stopped. Has he? Yeah. And is looking at them. Is he really? Yeah. Oh, he's still coming. A couple of steps. They must have a strike zone. Like 100% have got a strike the zone. The wildebeest has seen them and is turning around. Oh, oh, they're going for a wildebeest. Oh, everything, everything scattered, everything moved. Except for the cubs. Oh, but look at the cubs all stand up. Being like, what the fuck? What's that? There are five cubs. Yep. Another one has just appeared. Oh, the wildebeest, he lived. He's over there. Well, where's the rest of the pride now? Because even Dad went. We've decided to move up a bit further. And this is what the lions keep looking at. Every now and then a straggler will head up the waterbed, up the creek bed. But now all these guys are the ones that were on the other side of the road. See, so they've come up further to cross. And they've all gone in a Congo line. Mm. But every now and then someone gets brave and walks up the, the riverbed. And then they come running back here to help. Like, look, there's even elephants up there. Elephants, impala, zebra, wildebeest, they're all sticking together today. Because the lions are hungry, they went on two chases. Mm. Fuck 
fucking another no. traffic jam. Just keep going slowly. I'm trying, but like traffic no. jam. Don't hit the car. Yes, nine and a half thousand rand. Oh, oh. My God. <laughs> slowly. He slipped. He slipped. Just go slow. There we go. Toot toot, Timmy. Slipped. No. Just keep going. He'll move. Thank you. Well, you did say you wanted to see wild dogs. <laughs> Somehow I feel we're getting lucky. I know, right? Where, where are the pups? So the puppies are all down there. Oh, there's more around the fucking corner. Like... Yeah, there's heaps. There's a good 20 here. So. That's unreal. There's all these ones. All these guys down there. They're all puppies. And these ones. All up here. This in is a thing. massive pack. Here we have the McValue meal for a lion. Hi buddy. You can keep going, sorry. We stopped to go to the toilet and stuff. We found this. It's called soft serve. <laughs> well, we know what soft serve is, but it's toffee and caramel flavored soft serve. But it's in a, like, squeeze me tube. Good. Mm. Does it taste like caramel and toffee or coffee? Because that's usually what happens. No, it's more caramel and toffee. Okay, good. Yay! So, going past, trying to get back to normal civilization, and we found Kaylee's. Yay! <laughs> the fat one, Shannon. It's Noah! He's huge, though, look. Massive. And there's a baby there too. Okay, so we just hit the jackpot. There is an elephant and a zebra. And then we have the water hole, which is full of water buffalo, zebras, warthogs, impalas, all the way around. And then on the other side of the road, just over here, Walking off already was a giraffe and some monkeys. And more buffalo. And more, oh yeah, more buffalo. So we really hit the jackpot down here. Yeah. Shannon, we don't have anywhere to go. It's like Jurassic Park, don't Shannon, you? go. No, please, no. You don't want to stay? You don't want to be this, please? Shannon, go. Go, go, go. Go, go. So we just found this little rest stop. And, uh, Somebody wanted me to video these skulls. These skulls are everywhere, aren't they? Yeah. Wow. Like the Skull Kingdom. We assume that this is this is elephant, hundred percent. All right. Like um, what's been clawing at the tree though? Like what? Yeah. Left it around here, maybe. Okay. Anyway, we stopped here for a toilet break. Yeah, toilet break. For like this poor guy. Have you not learnt your fucking lesson? Road. Stupid fucking thing. So. Yeah, you know, if you're from Bidvest car rentals, <laughs> don't watch this. <laughs> okay, it's totally not funny. We're not laughing about it. Look, we're laughing because we've both had a cry. I don't care what anyone says. An accident has happened. Why are you filming just me? Because <laughs> I'm <laughs> not driving. <laughs> yeah. It's an auto you might, car. As, you might as well have done that. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. It was not okay. It wasn't anyone's fault, and I would be the first to fucking point fingers at him if it was his fault. It wasn't his fault. But oh my god, it happened. It is three to four. We only came down this little dirt road because 
There's a whole pack of wild dogs back there, and we were just waiting. There's a chicken crossing the road, and you're not you fucking. It's still in. The <laughs> I was, I was hoping that it wasn't going to like. Learn a lesson here, Shannon. They're wild animals. They're unpredictable. So you can hear me clearly. <laughs> so. I think they're called honey mooners, honey couple, honey suckle. It's the tiniest, probably most endangered. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I just feel like a fucking horrible human being. We all know I laugh when I get nervous. We hit a fucking deer. I just cannot believe that it has happened. The little thing, it came from nowhere. We were going like 30 k's an hour. Like, we're going so slow. And it was short. The problem was it was the real little, little ones. And it was shorter than the grass. And he just come out and just went straight, right straight in front of us. Mm. All day we've been fucking avoiding impalas. And then a giraffe come out, didn't it? It was like, oh, you giraffe. murderers. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> They're un- they're fine, dude. They move. I, I can see them. See what I've been putting up with all day. You see what I've been putting up with. <laughs> Something moved at four kilometers that way. I'm sorry. What happened to the little one? It jumped out of nowhere. And what happened to it? It went underneath the car. Yeah. So, so all my fucking jumps and oh. Riri and Darren yeah, are now one hundred percent. Justified because no, the one time I didn't, he killed something. The I, we haven't been able to assess the car yet because you can't get out of the car here, and I don't feel like getting eaten by a fucking lion or a wild dog or or having Timmy's mates come and ram you. Stop saying they're Timmy's. That wasn't a Timmy. Timmy's are in part. No, you're right. He's a rare Timmy. We've only seen five of them today. You killed one. I've only seen 5,000 of them today. Uh, look, trust me, I haven't put a big dent in their population. Seriously, where the fuck is this? This is the longest 5 ks ever. <laughs> I need to check the fuck in front of the car. <sighs> We're going to get fined. Fun sure. story. Kaylee's paid the fine. Fuck and off, and I am. And the car insurance. Yeah, well, it's going to take long because you got to check the car for fucking murder damage. We've come to a very safe place to get out and have a look. Please, God. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> oh, no. Hayley. What? I'm just hanging off. Can I fucking help. 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 <laughs> Stop. the bumper. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, Shannon fixed the bumper because I can't deal with it. <laughs> I just can't. Oh look, a road. <laughs> I just, oh. Is up the tree worth the fine? I don't care. Gone for the kill. He's up his tree. He's had the kill for like two days. 
Yeah, he's finally come back. We have had the perfect timing. So there's a leopard in the tree. Do you remember Timmy? That was up the tree. He's That's not, a leopard. He's not, Timmy's not up the tree anymore. He fell. He's on the ground. Somewhere. <gasps> Shannon, hold it up. It's filming it. It's right there. Wait. Oh no. That's the coolest fucking thing I've ever seen in my life. No way. Just keep recording. show them this footage and be like this is why we are going so slowly I don't want to go around this no like, I'm too scared no because I don't want to I don't want to spook it yeah come on mate get off the road come on. please get off the road we are in a bit of a time crunch oh, don't, don't, don't come back oh. thank you thank you goodbye oh my lord we're gonna be in so much trouble oh, he's... we are never getting out of this park because of the fucking hyenas. Look at them all. Toot toot, mate. We, no, no, no. we gotta go. Put the fucking window up. <laughs> what? What happened? What happened? <laughs> More. What's he got? No, that's his teeth. No, he had something in his no, mouth. No, 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 it was teeth. Don't, just slow as fuck. I'm telling you, he had something in his mouth. Oh my God, we're going to be eaten alive. <laughs> Oh, 